Hello there. Disclaimer, this was actually the second episode, but somehow the first episode got chewed up by my recording software. So I might seem disproportionately enraged here, but it's because I just come from a 25 minute session of beating my face against the brick wall in Cutman's stage. So um, I was pretty aggravated at this point. Anyway, this is my playing and failing at Mega Man project, because I've always been terrible at it, and I walked away from it at the age of about 14 and never looked back. This is me looking back, by popular request. Enjoy. Hello, welcome back to Let's Fail Miserably at Mega Man on the NES. Absolutely disastrous run last time. Couldn't even get past the first jump in... Gutsman's stage. Did manage to get to Cutman, but he completely thrashed me to death. So, different approach this time. There was no point trying to pick up from where we got to the last time, because we didn't get anywhere. I was going to have to start over from the beginning anyway. So, let's try someone a little different. I shied away from Iceman, because ice stages and platformers are usually complete bastards, but maybe Mega Man will defy convention in that respect as well, so let's try it. Funny little Eskimo dude. Iceman, clear points. 50,000 clear points! He must be very clear. I don't know what clear points do, whether you earn them for being particularly transparent or what. <laughs> yes, I know. I do. Oh, what the motherfucking cocksack? God, that thing on its own could be a boss. Jesus. Oh, no, get away, you fucker. No, get back, you respawning tosser. No! Well, I'm almost half dead after two enemies. What the shit? No! No, you ass! Ah. Is it any surprise that young me, coming to this from the likes of Super Mario Bros. 3, gnashed his teeth in frustration and just walked away? Wrote it off as an overrated piece of shit. And I'm not convinced that it isn't. Look, that thing is too low for us to shoot. I mean, we can jump over it here, but I believe there are levels where you can't. So, oh, fuck, no. What's this? Torpedo penguins? What the hell? Oh, just, will you just, just get back? I need that help. Oh, no, and it's vanished as well, you complete monkey toss bucket, Capcom. God, I hate you with a vengeance. I mean, you won my favour with Street Fighter 2, but... Jesus! Mega Man must be the low point of your entire catalogue. Fuck off! Okay. Okay. Next one. Come on. Look, watch watch this shit. I defy anyone to say with a straight face that Mega Man isn't cheap. Will you get the fuck off me? No! Ugh. Piece of shit! No! Ah. Alright. I think we're past them, for now. Expect to see them later, because that's just the sort of thing Mega Man will do, I'm certain. Alright. Get away from me! No! Ah. The jumps are just too long for us to comfortably get over, so we have to put ourselves in harm's way. And these torpedo bastards never stop coming, so you can't jump without face-planting into one of them. I hate you so much, Mega Man. And what, you can't you can't destroy these things, you can only freeze them. What a cheap trick. Fuck me. Arrgh! God, I hate Mega Man with the fire of a thousand suns. I really don't get why people love it so much. How can anyone play the oh How can anyone anyone play this abject miserable piece of sadistic toss and claim it's even tolerable never mind one of the fantastic classic games of the NES library Oh fuck me a disappearing disappearing block puzzle while being harried by this speedy enemy that that's just impossible to kill because you aren't get low enough down to shoot it because Mega Man won't crouch because it's against his religion or something. Oh, fuck you! Just get away! Complete ass bag! No! Fuck! 
Oh, God, I have to get up. Fuck! Well, at least we got a checkpoint. That's something. Oh, drop me right in front of the enemy, naturally, because Capcom hate people. Just get that. Oh, the jump's too far. You have to. Presumably, you have to jump right from the very last pixel. Go, oh, fuck! Unless the jump button doesn't respond, of course. Classic platforming bullshit. Come on, motherfucker! Alright. Come on, come on. Just jump on. Yeah, oh, fuck. Make you. Oh! God! Really? Really? People sit there and say, no, Mega Man's not cheap. What do you mean it's cheap? It's not cheap. It's difficult, but in a really classy, well-designed way. Oh. The only thing I've played that's more offensive than this is Rock Bottom, and you all know what I think about that. Oh, oh no, you complete asshole. No! Fuck! And I want to point out again, for the record, that although I... I would never claim to be an exceptionally good player of games. I have been doing it for 25 years on a daily basis. I'm not without skills. Fucking Mega Man. Oh, shit balls. In what way is this meant to be fun? I would rather smack myself in the face with a boxing glove crafted from someone else's sick. <sighs> Rejoin me the next time I can tolerate Mega Man and see if it gives me a stomach ulcer. See you then, and thanks for watching.